What a wonderful day this is for this couple as we celebrate their love for each other and their future together. Tatiana and Janae Peters, we've spent the last 1,093 days together. And wow, what a journey it's been. Aside from the fact that I thought you were absolutely stunning, uh, your profound curiosity, compassion, Christian character, sense of purpose, and your glowing, witty, and hilarious personality stood out to me. It took some time to figure it all out, what would become of all of it and these feelings I had, but finally, making that decision to pursue this relationship was one of the best decisions of my life. No one has shown me as much grace and love as you have. You're a divine encounter, my true love, and my eternal companion. <laughs> you can't cry. You're gonna make me cry. <laughs> wow. I don't want to break you. I love you, Padre. I love you too. You're gorgeous. Gabriel, over the past four years, you have become my best friend, my prayer partner, and my safe place. When I think about why I love you, I have come to terms that there is simply not enough paper in the world to write that story. But for now, I'll say this. It's been 1,093 days since we started dating, and within that span of time, we have gone on so many adventures. From shooting weddings, graduating college, interviewing countless people for documentaries, lake days, so many cooking victories and disasters, and countless other memories. While all those have caused belly laughs and happy tears, I have a feeling that this will be our favorite adventure yet. You know, Gabe, I have never felt more loved by anyone in the entire world. Your ability to love me with such intentionality has caused me to gather a better understanding of the Lord's love. I vow to always love you, hold you, and keep you through the good times and bad. I vow to honor you with everything that I am, whatever I'm doing, and wherever I am. I vow to embrace you and cover you with prayer. When you're weak and life gets tough to carry, I will intercede for you until the burden is lifted and peace floods your heart. I vow to love you forever because you're my always and forever baby, and I'm so happy to marry you today. I love you. Today my vows to you are to support you, to push you closer to Jesus, to love you with a godly love, to celebrate you not just for what you accomplished but for who you are. Gabe, the truth is your love has healed parts of my heart I didn't realize was possible. All my favorite memories are with you and I couldn't imagine my life without you and I've never felt more heard or understood by anyone else. By the power vested in me by God and the state of Indiana, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Gabriel, you may kiss your bride. It is my pleasure to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Gabriel Willard. Gabe, when Ty 
first told me about you, I knew you were the one for her and I didn't even know you. Thank you for gracefully taking the chauffeur position that was forced upon you that I no longer could fulfill because I'm miles away. I love you both and always remember to drink water, love Jesus, and love people like Jesus loves you. <laughs> Name's Jacob. You're not only my brother, but my best friend. Uh, done absolutely everything together from the very beginning. Um, I just remember Todd first came uh, to Bloomington to do school, and she first came to church. Like There was this almost immediate connection between them, and they quickly became best friends. There was one moment that uh, Todd was actually teaching a class at um, the church, and I had stepped in to kind of like be supportive and like listen and see what was going on with the youth. And I remember as she was, as she was talking and giving her lesson that um, I just, the only thing that I could think of was Man, she's perfect for Kate. Uh, but I'm very proud of them and excited to watch their love story grow um, now that they're officially husband and wife. 